guys. It's CJ with Paint Look Screaming Kennels. Finally getting to get back out here tonight. It's been about a month since I've been out, so uh, I'm pretty excited for it. Got my dad and my brother with us, Hobo and Molly. It's a little cool tonight. I think it's low 30s right now. It's supposed to be dipping off into the mid to low 20s tonight. Sky's pretty clear. Been a long week at work, so hopefully we can get out here and tree a coon or two for y'all and uh, show it and um, hopefully shoot it out. But uh, I'm just happy to be back with y'all and I hope y'all enjoy the hunt. Hey guys, real quick before we get into the hunt, I want to give a huge shout out to our sponsor, NightlifeKennel.com. For any coon hunting needs you have, head over there, place your order. He'll get it out to you as soon as he can. And uh, he's great customer service. If, uh, if you need something, he'll find it and get it to you. So, he so head over there and uh, place your order now. Hey guys, just wanted to give you a little update. Uh, the dogs have opened up. You probably can't hear them. They're a good 200 yards away on the other side of a little knoll. And it's a little windy. But uh, when we get closer, I'm going to do my best to get y'all some more audio. So y'all stay tuned. Hey guys, just want to give you a little update. We've walked a little closer to the dogs. Hobo's uh, opening up pretty good. I was going to try and get it on video, but it's been a little tight on track tonight. So, yeah, and a little bit windy. But uh, I wanted to let y'all know that uh, he's, he's driving it pretty good. He's in a wood patch. We, uh, we're pretty sure he may put it up a tree there. We're hoping he does at least. So uh, y'all stay tuned, and uh, we'll be back to y'all here in a little bit. Hey, guys. They're about 500 yards away. I don't know if y'all could hear that or not. We're going to start walking to them a little bit, but it's sounding pretty good. Well, if anything else happens, we'll uh, give y'all an update. So stay tuned. Hey guys, I want to give you a little update. Both dogs have uh, pulled up and treed. Don't know if you can hear them or not, but they're about, what, 400 yards? 318. 318 yards. Y'all may be able to hear Molly there. She's hammering down. Well, we're gonna ease on to them and uh, we'll back to y'all here in a little bit when we get closer to the tree. If y'all can't tell, they're burning the tree down. They're sounding pretty good. We're going to close the distance on them, and uh, we'll see y'all when we get to the tree. Stay tuned. Hey, guys. We made it right here. Eye shot of the tree. Try to give y'all a little audio as we're walking up to them.
Right down in there is the dogs. There's Molly coming back to greet us. Oh, Hobo's still down there on the tree. Y'all stay tuned. We're going to pick our way through these uh, briars and we're back with y'all the tree. Speak to him, girl. Well, guys, we're going to shine the tree. Y'all look at it. It goes up. We're going to shine it the best we can. See if we can find something out here in the tree. Y'all stay tuned. Hey guys, just want to give you a little update. We searched the tree, we didn't see nothing in it. We believe it may have been a slick tree, so we searched it the best we could. Every limb, every nook and cranny of it. Didn't see nothing up it, didn't see no eyes. We've been about two weeks, give or take, since the dogs have been out, so we think the adrenaline, the rush may have got to them, but uh, 0 and 1 for the night so far. Y'all stay tuned. Hey guys, we made it back to the truck. I think we're gonna call it a one drop night. Wasn't too good, didn't see no coon, but we got to get out here and hear the dogs. It's always good to get them out and exercise them. So, uh, sorry we couldn't show y'all a coon, but I hope y'all enjoyed the hunt. And it's uh, always fun to get out here with family. So uh, stay tuned till next time and uh, put them up a tree.